So Mark, uh, a 3-0 victory, um, playoff place secured now? Yeah, uh, the boys are delighted in there. Um, to to get the playoff place is absolutely fantastic. Uh, we came here tonight to win the game, first and foremost, and results have gone our way, so yeah, he's brilliant. I must credit the players. I mean, they, they've delivered two performances and two results under real, real pressure, you know, um, and showed a team spirit and a, and a galvanised uh, ethic amongst themselves that, that's, that's quite excited me, to be fair. Performances, um, footballing-wise, I thought we played probably better in August than we did in these two games. But you have to understand, these are young men that, that are under big pressure to, you know, any drop of points, and we're out the competition. So we'll see how the draw goes uh, on Friday, and then hopefully the boys will return, you know, fully fit in, in three, four weeks' time, and we'll have them again for another ten days and galvanise that atmosphere and spirit that they're showing in abundance. Jack Wilshere was the first sub to come on, he really had a had an impact and laid in the first goal for Danny. Yeah, uh, Jack's a great player um, and we knew if he'd come on he'd create something and uh, he did He did exactly that. And you recognise the difficulty in the, at half time by making a change with Jack Wilshere coming on and also mm. Mark Albright and they, they had a big effect. Massive right? and I think Jack Cork as well done exactly what we asked him to do as he always does you know. Um, all the players who were sat on the bench have contributed fantastically well this last 10 days and then from that I ask them to go and contribute and have an impact on the game and to say that Wiltshire and Albrighton especially, let's say, had an impact on the game was an understatement and obviously Corky, certain individuals need to do the, the donkey work for, for maybe those two uh, and I thought Corky done exactly that for us as well. I mentioned to you last week that we'll, we'll be speaking to you after your first goal and you got that tonight, what was that like? Yeah, uh, it's come soon and I thought, like I said, uh, but yeah, it was great to score. Uh, it's always great to score a goal, but uh, for to do it for your country is something special. And uh, yeah, I'll treasure this moment. Word has to be said about Danny Welbeck, who kept huffing and puffing, worked extremely hard, had a few chances and then popped up with two. Yeah, I think what you've got to understand as well, a year ago when we went to Greece, Danny came off the bench as a substitute and then I bought him off again because I didn't think he had an impact in the game. Now, that for any, any footballer, is a difficult situation. It wasn't done for effect, but Danny showed up this time round. His training's been fantastic. His training's been that good, I couldn't leave him out the team. Now, I've probably, that cost Jack Wiltshire his place maybe on Friday, the fact that, that Danny Welbeck had done so well in training for me and his two performances in the games, and not just maybe the goals and the, the flashy things that you see from a striker, his work ethic, he's put two or three of the best tackles in I've ever seen in my life, you know, and, and his work ethic was fantastic and I'm very, very proud of, of the way he's, he's come into the squad again this season with his towel up and said, right, I'm going to really contribute at this level. Last week we proved we can beat the big teams like Portugal and that, so yeah, I think definitely we'll, we'll take whoever whoever's put in front of us and we'll, we'll do, do our best. And finally, it was a, it was a great performance, great two two wins uh, that you wanted coming into this get together following the, the Greece defeat it's a world of change since March yeah I think um, I don't know I think maybe if I'm being honest we I got some things wrong if I'm being fair uh, to the squad I think maybe I, I've tried to play in a manner that was successful to us in the last campaign that, that probably wasn't conducive to this set of players um, so I'll take responsibility for that but maybe uh, Hopefully, uh, I've realised that in time to get us to the championships, you know.